Hi, it's Stephen St. Laurent from StephenStLaurent.com. OSHA training that doesn't bore you to death in English and Spanish. I want to talk to you about on-site OSHA training. And here's the thing, I go after people, I go after the trainers that are boring, that just read off a slide. And here's one of the things I do. I come in there and I say, alright guys, you know, let's get our feet wet, let's do the introductions later, let's get right into some content. So I throw on a little safety video. It's a really powerful three minute thing, gets us in the mood. Then I say, all right, you ready for the test? And everyone's like, what, the test? You know, because that's what people say, oh, you know, I don't want to go to safety, it's boring. And they don't want tests and stuff like this. And so what I do is I come out with an easy button, another easy button, and I get them into two teams, and I do construction family feud, or in the manufacturing facilities, I do OSHA family feud, and I get teams yelling at each other, two different teams, captains, and, and I just use that as a springboard to have some fun because you can't put a price on fun and engaging the workers and challenging them to put it into practice in their personal and their professional lives because safety's got to be 24-7. So that's just part of the flavor. Um, talk to me. The other part of my trainings is as much fun as I have, I've been in a lot of companies where there's been a fatality and so, you know, it's kind of like, what do you say after a fatality? I have a blog post in my Safety Bites uh, blog. Um, you know, what do you say after a fatality? And so as much fun as I have, I have a serious tone, constantly challenging people to say, why do I do the things I do safety-wise? Why do I pick up the phone when I'm driving? You know, oh, oh, and you know, you're searching for a, a phone number and an email. You know, could you die from that? And sometimes we miscalculate the risk. Would it be a bad day for your family and your kids if you didn't make it home because you decided to make a bad decision safety-wise? And so whether it's at work, at home or on the road, you got to be 24-7. So that's what I bring to the table, some fun and some challenge. Challenge people. If they make one change after my training, then I've done my job. You know, they could go home and they could plug up all their outlets for safety locks, or, you know, for the kids. And I did my job. You know, I'm challenging you constantly. Why do you do the things you do? And let's put it into practice, baby. So I look forward to the chance to train you. Please go to the contacts page and request a quote. Call me up, whatever it takes. It'd be my pleasure. Thanks so much.